<laughs> and so I tell her she has no legal personality. Uh, uh, well, usually I get a different response from that. Oh, oh, I I'm sorry. I see some friends over there. I gotta go. Well, hello, hello, my dear friends, my dear viewers. Welcome back to the channel. And today, as you can see, and by this magnificent bad, bad joke that I decided to start the episode with, we are back in the world of Kingdom Come Deliverance. We are here in Ledechko, where I plan on taking on the next main mission, which is, as you, as you probably remember, on the scent. We are on the trail of one called Ricky in here in the town of Ledechko. Now, we have two optional objectives, and those are the ones we are going to fulfill today. We have to go and talk to the bat wench, whose name I forgot, and we can go and talk to Ricky's father. Now, I'll probably go talk to the father first, because I don't know why, but I think... I think that we won't get much of an answer for him anyway, so... We might as well get him out of the way. Now, if you remember, last time we ended our adventures in uh, Sasau, we went around picking some locks here in the monastery area, and we nearly damn got caught. In between episodes, there happened a lot. A lot of things happened. I leveled up some skills, I'll show them to you in a bit. I did a lot of herb picking. Don't worry, I didn't do any main missions or anything. The only thing I did was the sort of continuation of a friending need and I finished a friending need. I have footage for that. It's not footage like this where I am with you speaking and commenting as I go along, but it is just footage I captured of the mission. Nothing really happened, but I might release that one day. And yeah, I leveled up a lot of skills. As you can see, I can show it. I now have a lot of skills. Herbalism is the one that's the proper one now, Herbalism 14. And I also got a lot of levels in reading. Uh, one in pickpocketing, but this was because of a book. I read the book on pickpocketing and... And so, yeah. Oh. I might want that. I also started to invest into maintenance and I started to learn how to use the grindstone, which is really, it's a really cool mini game. And also I did some alchemy. I'm alchemy level three now, but I plan on do much more of that to get it up even higher. As for the main level, nothing much changed. I am at level 10, strength 10 as well, because I got the, the perk from herbalism that allows me to level up strength as I pick herbs. And my vitality and my agility are also pretty much the same. My speech got got up a bit as well. So yeah, that's what I've been doing. Combat not so much. Um, I mean, yeah, I did some training with Captain Bernard, but overall, nothing really that worth it. So yeah, let's move on. Let's speak with the Tanner, Ricky's father. Jesus Christ be praised. All right. All right. So I want to talk to you about your son. I'm, I'm your wounded. Son. Any idea where he might be? I don't know nothing. Oh, told you. I know where he usually goes. It's important. He next shows up at home once in a blue moon, so I don't know nothing about where he gets to. Even if I did, why would I tell every Tom, Dick, and Harry? Well, first things first, I'm neither a Tom, neither a Dick, neither a Harry. I'm a Henry. Second, I am... Why is my... Oh, is, is it because of my clothes? Oh, it has to be because of my clothes, isn't it? Ah. But, nevertheless... I... Can I ask him who his friends are? Do you Let's at least try. know any friends he's with, or someone he goes to see? As far as I know, nobody here in the village talks to him. I heard he's seeing some bathhouse wench. Maybe. He can't get it for free, so I suppose he has to go to the baths. Okay, so let's... Yep, yeah, Hinek is in trouble. Your son is about to get into deep shit. <laughs> I'm trying to find him so I can warn him. That's nothing new. He's always oh. up to his ears, isn't it? 
but this time his neck's on the block. He got mixed up with some very dangerous people. I have to find him. All right. He was here a few days ago, but he left right away. He looked like... like he was in a hurry. And you don't know where he went? I've got an idea, but I don't know where it is exactly. I don't follow. Enoch makes some money on the side from poaching. He boasted to me a few times about what a great hideout he found in the woods. But he never told me where it is. Well, it's not much to go on, but it's better than nothing. Thank you. All right. Butcher's hideout. Any clue at all where his hideout could be? I really don't know nothing about that. I could tell when he'd come from there is all. How's that? Because every time he brought some hides for tanning and money. Ah. He had money because he sold the stuff right away. I suppose. He never kept any of his loot here. Do you know who he sold it to? No, but the innkeeper came here now and again and gave him coin. Of course, it could have been for me. All right. I'll All ask right. Him. The plot thickens. What more do you know? Nothing. I swear to God Almighty, I've said all I know. He all right, all right. Nothing. No need to bother the man. No need to no bother the man. You about it, but you must have noticed something, right? How much time did he spend away? What was he wearing? How did he look when he came back? Anything? Well, he came and went at all sorts of hours. I really don't know. Uh, except maybe one thing. He'd come home scratched with brambles and with leaves and muck on him. So he probably went through thick woods to get to that place. I reckon. What do I know? All right, all right. Let's... I'd like to talk to you about your Hinnock. I'm very busy, so make it quick. I mean, yeah, nothing really. Don't you have any clue... I really How's that? Okay, so it's every... okay. Go nothing new. So, really thank you, sir. Let's let's move along. Okay, so ah, yeah. I I, I figured now why the reason why the heart thing is so low. What what stat is that? Oh, it's it's the charisma. I think my charisma is so low because of my clothes. Yeah, because. Uh, I was trying to go to a more stealthy approach because when I was in between recordings I tried to do some... well I did a, a bandit hunt for uh, Captain Bernard and of course I tried to go in guns blazing and tried to fight them in combat but of course that wouldn't... that wasn't any good what else you, sir? so I ended up trying a more stealthy approach and just kill them all in their sleep at night. It worked! So I'm trying to go for a more stealthy approach, especially for when I do lockpicking. I want to ask about so, the courier's son, Hinnock. Yeah. And ask someone else. They have nothing to do with Riki. Are you sure? Customers away. <laughs> really? I heard a different story. I heard the two of you do business together. Who are you anyway? A friend of Hinnock's. He's gone missing and I need to find him. I don't know where he is. But if you find the bastard, tell him he still owes me some goods. Alright. So what should I choose? I have no time for evasions. Buying from poachers is a crime. I can do that, it will succeed. I can pay him. Let's see, owes you something. What about it? Well, supposing I settle the account for him and you stop dodging my questions and tell me what I want to know. <laughs> Ah, no, 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 I no, 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 right. How much is it? Before he vanished, I paid him in advance for five hairs. That many? You're not going to run around the woods all day chasing hares. Then you're about as much use to me as Riki. Oh, shut up. I'm not... <sighs> I, I, I feel tempted to go the, the sword, the sword route. Let's try speak to him. I don't give a damn what deals you've been doing together. I won't tell anyone. I just need to know where Riki is. It's urgent. What have our deals got to do with where he disappeared to? <laughs> Everything. It's likely Riki is hiding out at his poaching lair. And believe me, it wasn't hard to find out who was buying game from him. And it's even easier to go to the castle and tell them. Poaching's a crime, after all. All right, all right. Give me your word of honor. You won't tell anyone about our deal. I, I just. Fine. 
So, what do you want to know? Everything. How much game did he bring you? Not much. A few pieces. There's no great demand here. Sometimes the gentry hears something, otherwise it ends up in sausages. <laughs> All right. I hear Hinek has a hideout in the woods he uses for hunting game. Do you know where it is? Not exactly. That is... I don't know where it is at all. Oh, uh, come on, Jesus Christ. But I happen to know it's a dark place. A cave or an old mine shaft. Okay. You know? Whenever Riki was going poaching, he always came to me first for candles and lamp oil. He brought the game skinned and gutted, so he had to have a light for that. Okay. And do you know of any mine shafts nearby? There's a few of them around. There's one on the opposite bank, a short way off the path leading from the forge to the west. Then there's a mine gallery to the east of the village, uh, up in the woods above the cliffs. And I heard there's one shaft on the headland close to the water. Thank you. Okay, so there's three possible places. Watch you don't break your neck, though. It's rough ground, and you could easily fall down a shaft. All right. The Lord watch over you. Okay. I'm just going to have to tweak some options here so give me a second Pater Nostra, qui es in seris sanctificato nomen tuum veniat regnum tuum fiat voluntum yeah okay so I just tweaked I just gone and tweaked the sound just because it was a bit too loud so okay let's talk to the bathhouse lady and just let's be done with it should we take a bath let's let's take a bath yes i was use the bathhouse services uh heal my wounds bath and laundry i just i just need that so uh, i'll certainly need a physician but of course Yes, I'll pay, no pro I, I won't even haggle, just just pay the lady. I'm sure you'll be extremely satisfied. Yeah, I don't need anything else, just... I don't need... I don't need ladies for today, uh, I'm on a mission, I'm on a mission for the lord of this land, not the one above, you know. I suspect that one won't have... won't like to have anything to do with me. Alright, thank you so much. All right, now where is the lady? Inside? Of course, I can't go inside. <clears throat> uh, yeah, I I need to speak with you. Yeah. Yes. Thank thank you, Adela. Hello. God be with you. You need anything? I do. Yes. I heard you've been seeing Hinek, the Tanner son. So what? Come to preach at me, have you? That I'm a loose woman. No, a no, 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 no. Decent men. Well, he was no decent man, so. I just wanted to ask you a few questions. It's not my business how you live your life. Yes. I'm glad to hear it. Some folk don't care for the way I make a living. I can imagine. Lady, I couldn't care less so, how you wish what about to. You, then? you look a bit careworn. A bath with a bit of company might do you good. I just had the bat, but mayhaps later. Now I have some questions. Right now, I have some questions to ask. Ask away then. All right. Where's Hinek? Where can I find Hinek? I haven't seen him in the village for a few days. He must have gone ah. to the woods again. Does he do that often? From time to time. What the hell does he do? All right. I, I don't know. Are you sure you don't know? Uh, uh, uh. Okay, so I can choose two options, but they will have the same. I, they will both succeed. I just say I'm a friend. My friend, and I really need to know where he is and what he's doing. But I already told you I don't know where he's got to. So I suppose he just goes to the woods to pick mushrooms, does he? Mushrooms? No. More like bears ah. or other game. So Hinnick is a poacher. Well, that's no surprise. Well, he was never much of one for an honest trade. Who you know can exactly say where he goes? Maybe he has some favourite spot he might have told you about? He said he has some hideout in the woods, but he didn't tell uh, me. Okay. When did you last see him? A few days ago. He came to me late in the evening, drunk. And that was unusual? I never
never saw him drink much. He always came to me sober. So he was acting strangely that evening? He was strange. I had the feeling he was afraid of something. He kept prattling on and didn't seem to care about you know what. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> right. So, can you remember anything he said that evening? Oh, oh I'm not sure. Yeah. He went on Limpy about Lubosch. some fellow called Lubosch who died. That he was regretting he ever got into it, but he never said what it, it was. It was the Neuhoff attack. And that it wasn't worth it for the money. Aye. And then he was talking about the money. That was very odd. Yeah, it was the Neuhoff attack. What did he say about the money? Just that he had a pile of it hidden behind his house. Ooh! What did he say to that? What could I say? He was drunk. He kept saying I was a fine girl and other harlots wouldn't go with him even for money. And if I wanted, I could even take half the money and leave. Or he'd go with me and we could get married and such. Oh, just poppycock. So, did you go there for a look? No, I've got better things to do. Obviously, he made it up. Oh, but I'm going to check it out. Like Oof. So <laughs> yes, I understand. All right, where exactly is it hidden? Exactly where he, hid it. he said he buried it at his father's small holding in the western corner. All right, thank you. All right. Okay, so. Back, no one else is it true? Okay, what other whores wouldn't go with him even for money? The other bathhouse girls are honest, so I don't know. The truth is, I felt a bit sorry for him. Folk don't like him, but it's only because his old man is a grouch and a tanner. So, you only felt sorry for him? Both of us are the black sheep of the village. There's nothing more between you? No, nothing. Maybe Hinnick thinks differently, but that's how it goes. Hmm. I found out that Hinnick goes poaching in the woods and he's got a hide out there. What do you know about it? Um. Don't worry. Hinnick has much bigger problems than being caught poaching. And you're not involved in it anyway, are you? No, I'm not. It's true he used to go hunting in the woods sometimes. When he came back, he'd usually come to me. That's all. Hmm. How did you know he'd been to the woods? He always talked about what he caught. And he never came to me at other times. Probably <coughs> didn't have the money for it. <laughs> Do you know who he sold it to? He never told me straight up. But who could he sell it to? The innkeeper, I reckon. It makes sense. For sure. Yeah, we've been there already. Been there than that. Do you know what route he took? At least the general direction. Anything that could help me find his hideout. I think he usually went through the woodcutter's camp. Because he always brought me freshly chopped firewood. And he had wood chips on his boots. Good. Mm. So at least I know where to start. Thank you. All right. So. I mean, are there really other options? Okay, no, not really. So, okay, let's back and let's end the dialogue. Thank you very much, Adela. Okay, now. Alright, so we do... Oh my! So we have actually four locations we can check. Oh, bloody hell. But she did say the woodcutter's camp. Where is the woodcutter's camp? Oh my god. Alright, let's first, and because you know me, let's first get his stash. You know. Let's first get his stash. I'll end up breaking my legs. I'm resisting the temptation of starting to gather all these flowers. Like, there is an oddly satisfying sensation about just go around the map picking flowers everywhere. I know it's weird, but my god, you should see me play Skyrim. I never go on a straight line, ever. Like, okay, so she said behind his father's place on the western corner. 
So there is something on the western corner. Is it this thing? Is is this his stash? I mean, I I guess, I guess it could be. Where's my last save at? Okay, so it's nine minutes ago. Do I have any saviors? Yeah, I I will eat the savior snaps just for the lull of it. Okay, so really, that's that's his stash. Oh, that can't be it. I mean, that that can't be it. Let's see. Oh, she did say something about Western Corner. So I mean. Aha! Aha ha ha! Wait, I, I, I saw it! Aha! Here we are! No, oh, yeah, I, I thought that was strange. That, that, you know what that, that is? That's probably the Tanner's inventory. Or some, or some sort. Ooh! Ooh! Wait a minute, I... I must make sure that no one's seeing me. Ah, well, could be worse. 150, 115 Groschen could be worse. I'm not gonna take the gambus, and I don't even think I can. Yeah, I don't even think I can repair it with my kids. So, all right, I got Ricky's stash. Okay, so we still have time to explore one of these locations. So, hmm. I've been here. I've been here because this is a place of one of the treasure hunts. And I don't think... And I don't think that this is the one, because as I said, we've been there and there wasn't really anything there, but I'm gonna go anywhere just in case. Ow! Come, Pebbles! I've been doing a lot of studying on this game, on mechanics, on just general items and skills. I've been doing a lot of studying, and sometime soon, not not next episode, I, I'll probably do it off screen, but I'll record it for you guys. I'll go and take care of getting some gear for Pebbles. Because Pebbles deserves it. Like, I'm not gonna get the best horse in the game. I, I saw videos about the best horse in Kingdom Come Deliverance, but I'll, I'll probably won't get it just because just because I don't really want it. I, I like Pebbles. Honestly, I like Pebbles. He's a cool horse, he has a cool name. And I think... I think it's best if we keep... Pebble? What is that? Is that a body over there? Oh, God! Oh... God! Oh man, how the hell did you... An accident? This? He must have fell from up there. Is there something up there? I mean, he must have fell from up here. But... Is there anything here? Oh wait, it's more on this side. How the hell did he manage to do this? Alright. No matter. I am up here. I actually wanted to come up here, so... Come, Pebbles, my teleporter. My teleporting horse. 
But yeah, I have been here. I have been here before. I found the mine shaft. I think it's the same mine shaft they're telling me to go now. Because it is the it is where one of the treasures is. I believe it's the treasure you get from the map you buy at Votava. Interesting sight. What is an interesting sight? You get from Votava in uh, in Tolmberg. Okay, open. Nah, nothing really that interesting. I mean, the bow is valuable enough, so I guess it warrants the. I guess it warrants the the getting. I don't remember if this is the interesting place here. Ah, okay. So yeah, this was the one. Oh, okay, so it may not be. May not be the same. This is where the treasure is. You know, if, if you want to come here, yeah, if, if you have not already and if you haven't watched the guide already, this is where the treasure is. So, yeah, this is the mine. This is the location on the map. So, yeah. But now it seems it is not the place I'm looking for. So, there is another mine shaft or another. I think I know the place. I think I've been here as well. It, it, it's an open space, isn't it? Yeah, it is. It is this. Oh. Okay, some shrooms. I mean... Ah! Here it is. I was, I was right on top of it. Oh my. So... Ooh! Cave mushroom. Okay, so... This is just it. All right. So that that's it. Kind of kind of underwhelming, to be honest. But uh, yeah, I mean, hmm. Because yeah, I really don't know where the woodcutter's place is. I mean, I could assume it's one of these, but I also want to go and explore. Ask at the ah okay so the woodcutter's camp is right over there ah okay so they do tell us the one that's most likely to be I mean I guess I could go and explore all the others I mean I might find some loot conciliation oh oh it's a grave Daniel Waters okay. an oddly specific name all right I mean I guess we can finish here for the day because yeah yeah I mean we've done quite a bit can I cross the river I don't think I can oh Oop. All right, no, I cannot cross the river. Sadly. Just let's just wash our paws, Pebbles. You know what? We need a good washing. And Levechko is just right around the corner, so we can cross there. I think I might be able to cross here. Yeah. I can cross here. Alright, I'm just gonna go to this one real quick. Oh, oh god. Oh god, I, I, I'm I, stuck. I hate this, like... Oh god. Oof. I'm free. I'm free, everything's okay now. Okay. Yeah. Pebbles is not very good to cross country. Okay, where is this sound coming from? Like, I would assume... Yeah. It's from this place. But now I don't hear it anymore. 
That's weird. Alright, let's just do this one. Yeah. That is probably not going to be the one. Yeah, the, the woodcutter's one is the one. Yeah, okay, so this is disused, it's just like this. No loot, nor anything. Alright. Okay, so, and with that, I say it's about time we finish. We are already on the mark, on the 30 minute mark. I promised myself I was going to try and do this a bit smaller, but as you can see, that hasn't happened. So, my dear friends, my dear viewers, I say my goodbyes to you. I hope you have enjoyed this video. I'm sorry for there not having been a Kingdom Come Delivers video on Friday. But yeah, I just had a lot of things to do around the house. Uh, even though everything's as is, we now spend much more time at home and therefore things pile up. But if you have enjoyed, please do leave a like, a comment, and if you'd be so kind to go the extra mile, please subscribe to the channel for more. And I will see you next Friday or in any other day with another video. I bid you all a fantastic day and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.